Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to create triangle cornrows to yourself. I also show two different hairstyles using these cornrows. Beginning the hairstyle by creating the rectangle part line to the side. Then I share that piece in two and I create diagonal partings to the each side so that middle will be triangle shape like this then I will start the braiding I take three strands from the front and start to move strands from side under to the middle I'm also adding hair from the both sides of the braid. So left under, add hair. Right under, add hair. Left under, add hair. Right under, add hair. Left under, add hair. And right under, add hair. Keep on repeating this pattern. Next, I take the topmost piece, spray some water and create the similar braid in here that I did below. So, three strands, move the strands from side under to the middle and add hair from the both sides of the braid. And at the end, I create the similar braid to the middle. Again, three strands, and then move the strands from side alternately under to the middle. Add hair from the both sides of the braid. And here's the final look of the first hairstyle. Next, I will create the big dot braid with the corals. So, again, you need three strands. And then you just start to move them from side under to the middle and adding hair from the both sides of the braid. So right under, add hair, left under, add hair, right under, add hair, Left under, add 
that hair? Right under add hair and left under. To get more bigger braid, I also pancake the edges of this bigger dot braid and that just makes the braid look much more volumized. Even if your hair would be thinner, it makes so much more volume that it doesn't even look the same technique as the small ones. When I get to the back, I add the cornrows inside the dot braid. So here you can see the first, add it in and now add hair regularly at this point from both sides and after that I bring the hair under and add the middlest braid inside like this. Just make sure to tighten the braid well because to me it easily gets too loose and the braid won't stay nice inside the bigger braid. And next I will add the last braid inside the bigger dot braid in the similar way as I did before. Next I just braid until I've added all the hair inside and after that I continue braiding without adding. And here's the final look of the second hairstyle. Thank you for watching this video. If you liked, please hit the thumbs up and subscribe my channel. Have a great day!